What's up guys, Dreamcast Guy here, just got off a 10 hour shift, only to find out that Microsoft has completely backed down on everything they were saying, uh, everything that the, the Xbox One is about, which is funny because the Xbox One, even its name is supposed to be that it's this one sentient amazing being that just seethes in the corner and soaks up all entertainment. And instead, now everything that made it the one has kind of been undone here. Uh, not that I was fucking thrilled about the one in the first place, but it's funny that everything all their advantages have now been reversed. Uh, there is uh, no more online requirement. The always online requirement, uh, the console no longer has to check in every 24 hours. All game discs on Xbox One will now function as they do on the Xbox 360. So I guess that means they can still put the uh, EA online passes in there. So EA is definitely already... All over that. Uh, let's see. Uh, internet connection is only required when initially setting up the console. All downloaded games will function the same when online or offline. Region locks have been completely removed and no additional restrictions on trading or loaning discs. So that means it's just a fucking PS4. That's cool. I mean, I, I don't know how I feel about this right now. I mean, Microsoft kind of fucked with us. Microsoft kind of fucked with us hard. But I... I like it. I kind of still like the Xbox. It's poorly designed. They, so many of their fucking the things they're going for just seem stupid. But I want to like it. I want to believe in the system. I really do. It's just a shame that it's being made by motherfuckers with Down syndrome. I just I want to love it. But right now I'm still leaning towards PS4. PS4 just looks better still. Uh, maybe it's just because Sony is handling so much of their stuff better. The fact that Microsoft is having to have the entire fucking, like, Amazon basically told Microsoft doing that, there was that thing when 95% of all votes for what will you pre-order, a PS4 or a uh, Xbox One, and 95% of people voted for uh, the PS4. So I guess they finally woke up and went, hey, if we want to keep riding the money elephant to money town, then we definitely need to listen to our customers, not our consumers, our customers. That if we're not keeping people happy, then uh, they're just going to fucking jump ship. It's not Xbox One isn't the only system out there. There's more than one choice out there. So, sorry, this is a ranty out update. It's, it's midnight here, and I've been working since one. So, I'm very tired, but I had to do that update. Holy shit. Please, guys, let me know in the comments uh, what you guys think. Uh, I'm, I'm so conflicted by this. I'm still probably leaning towards PS4 at this moment, but after that new PS4 trailer where they showed exactly how the interface works, the share button is kind of weird, but it's cool that your PS4 can talk to your cell phone and all that. That looks cool. Oh, I'm tired. Okay, I need to go play some Dreamcasts. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Keep dreaming.